Hello again. It's, uh, it's obviously been around a year since I last did one of these kind of videos, so it's, uh, time to look back again and see what I managed to get done in 2022, and maybe talk about a few things that I want to get around to next year as well. So, I started the year off with the Dungeon Build Along project, and uh, I wasn't really sure how well that would be received, to be honest, but, uh, you know, a few people seemed to like it, and some viewers even built it, so, uh, I'm going to call it a success. And if you did enjoy the series, then you might be pleased to know that I am going to be doing a similar thing again in January. Um, like before, the plan is to try and release one video a week throughout the entire month, and, uh, and this time I'll be working on level 2 of the same dungeon, so uh, hopefully that'll be another fun little project. But as far as the regular episodes go, it looks like I managed to get 12 of them done this year, plus various bonus videos, but uh, yeah, I think an average of one per month isn't too bad, and uh, yeah, it would be interesting to know which of these you like the best, or what you've managed to get the most use out of. So, ideally, I'd like to do something similar next year, and uh, again, try to add some new stuff to all of the different ranges. So, for the tiny terrain, for example, that might be doing shorelines next, which would more than likely lead to tiny ships, which I think would be kind of cool, or, or maybe some stone textures so that we can build towers, walls, castles, and things like that, and um, maybe whole city hexes, I, uh, I'm not quite sure yet. Um, for the sci-fi range, I think I'd like to make a few mundane pieces next, so uh, things like tables, chairs, lockers, that kind of thing, or, or maybe stuff to make some kind of med bay, or something like that. And I've also got this kind of weird infected part of the station that I've been working on, so uh, yeah, there's that as well. And as for the dungeon terrain, well, there's always more stuff to do for the dungeon. But surprisingly, the most watched video of 2022 was the, the mini dungeon in a box thing, which was just a short bonus video really, so uh, maybe I need to pay more attention to that kind of thing. Though, I do have a few more time-lapse videos that I want to get around to, but it's, it's the usual problem of finding the time. But uh, yeah, other things on the to-do list are to maybe do some kind of collaboration video with one or two similar sized channels. Um, I also really want to go to at least one convention next year, uh, most likely the UK Games Expo, just as a visitor, um, even if it's just for one afternoon. And I keep telling myself that I am going to try and do more live streams. Um, I've even set up a Twitch account, but whether I do or not, well, that remains to be seen. Though, I do sometimes jump in the video chat over on Discord every now and again, and I occasionally do a bit of crafting and painting over there, so uh, there is that, I suppose. Oh, and it should go without saying, but I also want to say a big thank you to everyone that watches and comments on these videos, um, especially if you decide to pay a small amount for the PDFs, or if you support me over on Patreon, or here as a YouTube member. Um, I generally don't like to be too pushy about all of that stuff, but uh, I'm not gonna lie, it's a massive help, so uh, yeah, thank you. And on that note, I think I'll bring this one to a close. So. I hope you had a good 2022, and I hope we can all have a better 2023. So, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and I'll see you again in the new year, starting with Season 2 of the Build Along Project. So, thanks for watching, and bye for now.